Hey everyone, Leland from Rikers Reptiles. Uh, today we got a really special package. I haven't got a, a, a reptile shipped in here in a long time. So I want to go over the process for onboarding an animal uh, here at Rikers Reptiles and show you what we got. So stay tuned. Okay, so I got the box open and I want to show you how the ice pack was wrapped. This was a good idea. The ice pack was wrapped up really, really tight in the paper like this. So there's no way that the snake could get to it. I like that. I, I'll probably use this in the future. Oh, there you go. Okay, so here, here he is. Real beautiful crystal monsoon. So this is a Mojave special monsoon. He's gonna lift his head up here in a second. He's getting a little acclimated. Um, his eyes are real beautiful. Like a, kind of a silvery color, almost blue like a light blue or silver color really cool looking snake okay so the onboarding process is i'm see i'm in my loft i'm not even in my snake room i will not go in the snake room with any new animals uh until they've made it through quarantine so the very first thing we're going to do is we're going to take this snake and we're going to stick it in a bubble bath and then the next thing we do after that is we will treat it for mites you know, i don't see any mites but they always get treated uh, just in case so I do it the same way every time. Okay, so let's get busy Okay, so I always prepare a little bubble bath. I put a few drops of Dawn dish soap in a bubble bath I don't put the water too high just up to the the height of the back You don't want the snake swimming in here and I'll even put a little wash cloth in here to give it a place to rest its head if it feels like it's too uh, deep which uh, I'll be keeping an eye on it anyhow and I'll give it about a 20 minute soak so let's do that and I'll put this on pause and just to let you see the snake inside there see how the water is not above the snake it doesn't feel like it's floating or swimming around it's nice and relaxed in there that's what you want to see you may have to if the snake stays in the same position the whole time you may have to um, kind of open it and get the bubbles up on its back you want the suds to hit all of its scales so that if it did have mites they slide right out is the theory and then um, the mite spray will kill anything that comes off and then it'll go into quarantine. Okay, it's been 20 minutes and now I'm going to get this snake out of its bath. It's been a really good snake, just sitting there chill. Now it's probably going to get a little spicy. So it's been in the bath, we're just going to, I dry him off. I want the mite spray to be able to stick to its body uh, and then it's going to go into the tub and we'll leave it alone and we'll give it water just enough water that it can um, like after the spray dries then I'll give it just enough water that it can uh, get a little drink but not soak tomorrow so I'll withhold water till tomorrow and then I'll just get enough spray on this to coat it and then wipe it off Okay, there you go. It's all ready to go into quarantine now. So this is Luke Skywalker 2. So Luke Skywalker the second. Beautiful boy. And uh, this is Triangle uh, Reptiles and Rodents is the, the gentleman who created this one. Okay, so this is my uh, quarantine rack up in my loft. So he'll go in there. And we'll get them all set up with some water a little later. And that's it. Beautiful color. Real good looking snake. And we'll see you in the next video, everybody.